Welcome to another beautiful day here at Mills Motors located at 240 Bond Street East in Oshawa. Today we're looking at the awesome 2016 Sierra SLT 1500 four-wheel drive crew cab with the all-terrain package shown here in the very nice onyx black. Under the hood it's rocking the Ecotec 3 5.3 liter direct injected V8 engine with the 8-speed automatic transmission. Taking a look at the inside of the truck, the upholstery is all leather and down here are the controls for the 10-way power adjustable driver's seat including lumbar support. On the inside of the driver's side door there is quite a bit of storage as well as the Bose premium speakers which do allow for the best sounding quality when rocking out to your music. Up here is the child lock, window lock, powered windows, powered lock and unlock and the powered mirrors including power folding mirrors. And up here are the two memory sets for the pedals, mirrors, and seats. Now getting into the truck is made simple and easy thanks to the 6-inch chrome assist step here that does run door to door. Starting on the left is the trailer brake, four-wheel drive selection, and the exterior lights. Behind the left-hand side of the steering wheel are the wipers and indicators. On the left-hand side are all the cruise control buttons and the heated steering wheel, which is very nice for those cooler months. And on the back here, we have these two buttons, which are for changing through the favorites of the radio. Over on the right are the two hands-free and Bluetooth buttons, as well as all of these buttons here to help you navigate your way through that driver digital screen. And on the back, there are the two buttons, which are for changing the volume of the radio. And now we're looking at the center touch screen where the truck does come with AM, FM, and XM radios, as well as you can connect your phone to it. That projection icon means that it is car Apple Play as well as Android Auto friendly. And it does also come with navigation. So as I press that, a map does pop up, which is quite nice and handy. There are also some settings, text message settings, and some OnStar settings to go through. And speaking of OnStar, up here in the rear view mirror, if you click that middle blue button right there, you will be connected to OnStar and they can help you out with any situation that you are in, including pinpointing a destination for you here on the screen. Below the screen are the radio controls, so volume on the left, changing of the stations on the right, and the radio button will switch between the AM, FM, and XM radios, and the media button will switch between the USB import, auxiliary import, or any Bluetooth devices that are connected. Beneath the radio controls are the aircon controls, which does include front and rear defrost, as well as dual climate control. So I can have the driver set to 16, passenger set to 18, which is quite nice for when the driver and passenger do have different temperature wants. It does also come with heated driver and passenger seats, which is nice for those cooler months. Below the aircon are a bunch of cool buttons here. So starting on the left, this button will move the pedals towards and away from the driver. Traction control. This button here will turn on some lights to the exterior truck bed, parking assist, and hill descent assist. And below all of those, are, there are a bunch of charging ports. So there are two USB ports, two auxiliary power outlets, and a power outlet. And in between the seats, there is a decent amount of storage, two cup holders, as well as this nice armrest here with a nice spot to place your phone. And if the phone is wireless charging capable and you place it here, when the truck is running, it will begin to charge, which is quite the handy feature. Lifting that up on the inside, there is even more storage, as well as two more USB ports, an auxiliary import, and on this side, there is another auxiliary power outlet. Looking straight up from there, there is this gorgeous sunroof, which is perfect for letting in some of that fresh air and sunshine. But if it is a little bit too sunny outside, you can always pull that shade over and block it all out. And that is controlled and operated using the buttons located up top here. And just to the right of that is the button that operates the power rear sliding window, which is also great for letting in some of that fresh air. And just ahead of that are the three garage door buttons, which is nice and convenient. And now making our way over to the passenger side, there is a top glove box, which offers a decent amount of storage. And then there is a lower glove box, which offers a little bit more room and space for some of those bigger items. And on the passenger side door, there is the powered lock and unlock and the powered windows, as well as the Bose premium speakers. Have a look at those gorgeous 20 inch ultra bright machined aluminum wheels there that look very nice. And as we make our way over to the rear of the vehicle on the corner here, there is this nice corner assist step, which is quite handy and useful for getting in and out of the truck bed. 
and lined along this whole rear bumper. Here are the ultrasonic rear parking sensors, which do go hand in hand with the colored backup camera that does show up for you on the inside of the vehicle on the center screen, which is quite useful for when backing the truck up. The hitch is located down below and the truck does also come with the easy lift and lower tailgate system, which means when I pull on the handle, I can let the tailgate open nice and slowly all on its own. Once it is fully open back here, you can see there is quite a lot of room as well as some hooks lined along the left and right hand side, which is perfect for tying down any of those loose items. But if you do have any loose items rattling around back here, you do not need to worry about them scuffing up the paint or even doing minor body damage because there is this nice spray on box bed liner, which will help keep everything nice and protected. As well as that, underneath either side here, there are some lights that do turn on by a flick of the button on the inside of the vehicle, which will help light up this whole area when you are in a darker space, making it nice and convenient for when you are trying to grab something. Now closing the tailgate is again made simple and easy thanks to that easy lift and lower tailgate system. Now taking a look at the rear passenger side door here on the inside there is quite a bit of storage as well as the powered window control. Now getting into the back seat is again made simple and easy thanks to the 6 inch chrome assist step. Behind the passenger seat there is some storage as well as there is some behind the driver's seat. And behind this middle console, there are two storage areas, as well as this handy auxiliary power outlet, which is quite useful for charging some of the mobile devices. As I turn around here, you can see that the second row seating does support three people, but when someone is not sitting in this middle seat right here, just pull on that tab and down folds a center folding armrest, as well as two cup holders, which does allow for a little bit more of a relaxing ride. As well as that, I know if things, I know if you have three people back here, uh, things can get a bit warm. So thanks to this power sliding rear window, you can open that up and let in some of that fresh air and help cool everything down. What a gorgeous looking vehicle, both inside and out folks. And it does not stop with the stunning looks because it is also equipped with the safety and connectivity of OnStar, as well as having its very own 4G LTE Wi-Fi hotspot which does mean that you can safely search the web whilst in the vehicle, which will help move time along very quickly when you are going on some of those longer rides. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is the awesome 2016 Sierra SLT 1500 four-wheel drive crew cab with the all-terrain package shown here in the very nice Onyx Black. Under the hood, it's rocking the Ecotec 3 5.3 liter direct injected V8 engine with the eight-speed automatic transmission. If you want to test drive this awesome truck, we are located at 240 Bond Street East in Oshawa, and we would be very happy to show you that we will do whatever it takes.